Okay, guys, thanks for joining me back for part two of this is the urgent message for preppers uh, concerning the 2016 elections in the USA. Uh, so we, we left off at, at the NBC mask, which stood for nuclear, biological, and chemical mask. Uh, you definitely need to get those. They're becoming a little bit more harder to get. Uh, availabilities are, are very slim. Especially the canister filters, they're very, very hard to find right now. Especially the longer lo life ones, the 10 plus year ones, they're almost impossible to find. They're just not even made. The next item would be communication systems. If you don't already have a network of friends or preppers, uh, or at least a, a means to uh, monitor the airwaves uh, in your community, you need to get that now. Uh, these, these, these forms of communication and electronics are there. Uh, you also want to probably have at least one form of uh, communications that you, uh, that you protect. Uh, you put in a Faraday cage and you protect against an EMP, so at least you have some means to monitor the airwaves after uh, a major attack. If, God forbid, an American was attacked or a false flag was, uh, was done. The next item would be hardening the home and property. Do it now while you have the supplies, while there's a Home Depot, while there's a Lowe's, and wherever in your area, maybe an Ace Hardware store. While there's stuff here, fix your home up. Make your property not inviting to strangers and criminals. Increase your health. We've talked about this recently. Uh, yeah, get in shape. Uh, start eating real food. Uh, get some real nutrients in your body. Get some sleep. Uh, change the life, you know, and lifestyle until you, you, you know, one that, that agrees with you. You know, if you hate your job, get a new job. You know, if you need to make some changes in a relationship, do it. Uh, this is your freaking life. And, uh, and I'm upset about this because I see so many people just living a crappy existence and they're not happy. And it's so not necessary, man. This is your life. Increase your diversified means of wealth to weather volatile times. Now, this is something that you just got to think about. Don't put all your money in the stock market. So when it crashes, which it is right now, in my opinion, it start, word, start on, a, on a downward spiral. I think we've already peaked for the stock market in 2016, and it's all downhill from here, unfortunately. But we're in a bubble. And if you have all your money in stocks, uh, well, you won't have very much money you know, on the downside, especially if you have to pull it out. Uh, before it goes back up, uh, hopefully it will. The next uh, level here, or line, line item, would be uh, the emergency funds, uh, including cash holdings uh, in a secure location in the home. You, you definitely want to increase the, the, the means or even barter items uh, within the home so they're very readily accessible in case there's a so-called bank holiday, which is very likely and it has happened in many other countries in the recent history. And the last one is to spread out your preps between several properties, homes, and locations. It could be friends' homes, family homes. We talked about this. Don't have everything, you know, in your house. Don't put all of your food in just in your pantry and your kitchen. So those are some ideas. I just want to thank everybody for, for listening here. Um, you know, it's, it's, a, it's, a, sad, it's a sad topic. Uh, the future of America is very grim. Uh, we've got a bunch of losers trying to run for president here, and unfortunately they might win because we got a bunch of crazy, uh, uneducated voters that just allow all this. This is, this is not acceptable. You know, of all these leaders in America, we, we, have, we come down to a Hillary, which is a criminal, and, and Trump, which is a psychopath. Uh, I mean, seriously, uh, this, this, is, this is insanity. And this is so insane there is no other option in my mind that this was all set up ahead of time. This is all orchestrated. There, there is, this, is, this is so beyond logical. This is, so, this is all under control. The control to, to dictate who's going to be our leader so they could be the new puppet to replace the previous puppet, Obama, and his agenda, agenda to you know, fundamentally uh, change America. And uh, mark my words, we will have way less freedom and liberties in the, in the next few years than we do now. So do what you need to do to survive because this is becoming almost survival level in America. We've got a bunch of crazy antics going on, new world order stuff. We've got crazy UN agendas. We have all this stuff. Uh, bankers are, have been taken over uh, for over 100 years. The central banks uh, have, have taken over and conquered America from the inside. Sad, such sadness. But Americans just close their eyes and walk on like nothing's ever happened. Everything's just blissful because they got their McDonald's and their Taco Bells and their KFCs. They've got their cable TV and their new iPhone. So how can there be a problem? 
there's a freaking problem in front of your face because we're not free anymore and we haven't for a long time. Everybody be safe and uh, get your preps together. I'll catch you real soon. Thanks.